Then guys, the master yet here, and I'm in Nagrand. Uh, so if you watched the last episode, you'll know that I was making my way over to Nagrand, and I finally got here. It took me an extra like 15 hours, and well, maybe 18 hours, maybe, uh, to get here. And I've just been doing the AH and uh, got myself in the yak because I was getting fucked off with having to go see the transmog vendor. To be honest, so it's a fucking ugly mount, though. I think like well. Oh no, it looks a bit better now, but like it's a bit like a bit fucking big, and it? it's just a bit too big. So great for basically just sitting on fucking quest helpers. Well, quests. So we're in that grand. We're gonna start off our little lore master ting. Um, what are we looking at quests? Outland. Then we want to go Lawmaster of Nagrand. Okay, so 75. Easy enough. What we gotta do? I fucking love Nagrand. It's so nice. Just looks so cool. It's just like fucking awesome. I was also gonna turn my PvP on, guys, just in case people wanna people wanna rumble. They can rumble here. This is this is some good world will PvP spots i say this now and i'm gonna get absolutely fucking nailed i had my pvp on last time and like just got one shot by a uh, fucking max level and that mage that mage that mage fucked me i will kill mages though mages will be my i'm gonna fucking slaughter mages i reckon well i'm gonna try to anyway it's gotta be done this is another thing guys this character i'm not gonna give up with this character until I at least have 1800 rating so I can buy the fucking gear because that gear looks fucking sick if you know what I'm on about it's the PvP gear that you get from uh, you have well if you have like a over 1800 rating you can get the old PvP gear at level 60 the level 60 PvP gear and it looks cool as fuck In my opinion, it's a fucking cool set, especially the warrior one. <coughs> so it's going around killing these tower bucks, fucking this shit up. I feel like I've just been working all day, so it's just like getting around to playing and fucking just playing anyway. It's all right though. Ooh. You got fucking slain. Just keep pondering. It is very kill a fuckload of these. Kill a fuckload of these in that grand. But I, I quite like that to an extent. It's very grindy. And um I quite like that. But it's just quite grindy. So, let me tell you a little Something that I've been doing while I've been these all these extra hours of uh, playtime, but not actually recorded footage, is a uh, earlier today I was trying to transmog the replica. Fucking, um, I've got like the 200 mace basically um, from 1800 from my shami. Um, so I was trying to transmog that, and like I've just had to message a GM and stuff because turns out. Um, if you buy that gear, they put a. It doesn't spawn in your kind of collections until two after two hours after buying it. Simply because they're like no, because you could buy it, transmog it, and then refund it. Um, which makes sense completely. But I want to know like why the fuck is Blizzard being that tight on like a fifty gold item? It's like. Really? Is, uh, is is that the biggest reason? It's so not impractical, but I want to have my fucking mates now. Do you know what I mean? Even if it was like, yeah, just pay 100 G and we'll get rid of the cooldown on it. Be like, okay, because I don't need a two hour cooldown on my transmogs. That's ridiculous. 
but that's my little rant. But I did message Blizzard, um, life hack. Uh, if you want to get into contact with Blizzard, say something's wrong with your account, and then you'll be put in the live chat, and the average wait is like a minute, whereas before my average wait was three days. So, as you can imagine, it's definitely worth doing. That I'm Maddie. Maddie having to or whatever the fuck it's called. Uh where's it gone? There's nuggets there. Adamite T I don't know. I don't fucking know. Whatever. Those sell for a fuck ton on the auction house. They've been selling for like well, I say they've been selling. I've sold one because I only had enough mats to get one. Um but it's sold for like fifty gold on the auction house. Which isn't bad for a BC match, you know what I mean? So I've been trying to make some gold. I want to make like some gold on this character because I don't really like not having a lot of gold. Um, so I've started auction housing again, and it's just flipping shit really. You're buying shit. I, that's why I got my enchanting up so I could disenchant stuff for enchanting mats. So I've just been like just disenchanting a load of shit with. I don't even. Oh yeah, I do need two more of these. But let's go over here. Been disenchanting shit to get my. Uh, there you go, there's my little disenchant. To get uh, just mats on the auction house, and they're selling for a stupidly high price. But the thing is, they're selling for a stupidly high price, so I've gone in and I've like undercut by a crazy amount. But people, before I like placed a mark in the auction house, were selling like stacks of 20 uh, enchanting mats for like 150g, which is. That's fucking ridiculous. No one's ever gonna buy that. I don't think that's very fair, though. Do you know what I mean? So I was like, I'm gonna put them down for like, got them 90 g a stack, which I think is still ridiculously high. But um, they're selling, so I was like, okay, I'll live with that. Enjoying arms. I'm happy I went arms now. Like, saw a couple of people kind of saying in the uh, comments that, why well, you protection? And um, in answer to that, I am protection. Uh, well, I was protection simply because I just find it more fun, to be honest. It's just a bit more fun, isn't it? Like, well, I don't know. I enjoyed running around with the shield. Shield slam, obviously, as well at low level is crazy. Well, it used to be anyway. I was just going to. Oh, off the assumption that it still was pretty crazy and it was just nice being able to tag a fuckload of mobs and not have to worry about it like um even just having the gear but I've gone arms now for good simply because my gear my actual tanking boa is only up to level 60 so it's basically going to be shit now well, eventually, anyway. Maybe not right now, but definitely when I hit to 70, it's going to be below par, so had to go anyway. Is it not Blood Elf? Cliff Hoot Run. That's pretty cute. Oh, it's a lot of flying though. Oh, got some mining ore over there. Oh, there we go. Handy to level up my uh, mining as well. I was going to try to get my enchant into 400 as well before I go into Lich King. Um, simply because, well, Wrath. Simply because, oh no, it's just nice leveling them up together. They're not really good for leveling up together though. Um, like, if you were doing this setup on your first tune, I would really not recommend it. Simply because, really, if you wanted enchanting, if you do something like, well, jewel crafting, 
basically professions are only profitable when you have multiple tunes that can do multiple things so the point being like say if you had enchanting and jewel crafting you could make jewel crafting mats but then disenchant them and get gold for them for like half the price that you would have paid for the actual mats whereas if you have another tune that has mining so it can get you all the stuff that you need for jewel crafting you can then do the jewel crafting make the mats uh, so do the mining yourself make the mats with um, uh, make the fucking rings and shit with the jewel crafting and then send them all to a disenchanter to disenchant them all and then with the disenchanter you might have inscri inscription and do the same with like herbalism so but yeah that's that's the thing that's if you want to make money with professions you need a ha well professions really complement each other i think that would be the best way to put it i guess just want my fucking mace fed up with this staff it's cool I like this staff, this like the get it off a um quest for real reward in PC actually. It's a long fucking quest line though, I tell you, it's like a forty minute quest line. But um the staff is definitely worth it for the transmog. Alright. Arms is a lot more like, let's just fuck this shit up. Okay. Cliff pool. Might as well go over here, and then they're all... Dun, 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 dun. It is nice, not though, Nagrand. You've got to love it. You've got to love Nagrand. The old school Nagrand as well. The new one's alright. But it's not as cool, man. It's just not as cool. Interested to see how much damage my Ren does. Oh, fuck. That's quite a lot of damage. If I... Okay, so, wow, well, he was dead anyway, wouldn't he? Should we fucking do this? Let's fucking do this. Fucking. Calm, little bitches. Let's go. Let's go. Oh no. Oh no. I'm going down, guys. This is not a good idea. It's not a good shout. I need a stun for the other one. Uh oh. Nope, it's me. Ah. Take back the bitches. Obviously, I was the bitch. God damn. Fucking slain. All in the attempt to see how much rend. So, yeah, it does a fair amount of damage rend, really. Was it worth it? Absolutely not. Would I do it again? Most definitely. I might go, um... Oh, I've got the double charge, haven't I, at the moment? Double time. As it's called. Uh, where am I going? There should be. There we go. So I'm making my way. I've only done three quests, um, which is quite expected because it's going to be quite slow leveling. Um, but that's alright. That's alright. Can't be helped. I might do the same thing again, to be honest. Um, of kind of when I complete Nagrand, no matter, well, whatever level I am, I might then just do PvP until I get to. Um, 80 to be honest simply because uh, 70 even what am i talking about simply because uh oh no I, th I think i'd rather just finish nagrand and be like two areas in bc i don't want to lie i really enjoy pvp basically so it'd be nice just to pvp for the last couple of levels and see where warriors are at and see where other classes are at if you know what i mean but um 
that's going to wrap up this episode, guys. So I'm just going to be a running ghost to end. But thanks for tuning in, guys. And I will catch you next time. So take it easy. Teach me how to pound. Teach me, teach me how to pound. Teach me how to pound. Teach me, teach me how to pound. Teach me how to pound.